It's time for Around the Ozarks Rewind, brought to you by Kaleidoscope at the corner of Fremont and Sunshine. Here are your hosts, Woody and Janet. It won't go away on its own. It's, it's a three, two, one. Hello, baby. Hello. What's that? Pick you up at eight and don't be late. What's that? Oh, baby, you know oh. what I like. Okay, who am I doing? Who? Uh, Chubby Checker? No, 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 no. Am I close? I don't know. Jay plane. wouldn't know. He's too I young. I on the plane with Buddy Holly. I do know. He, he knows. He he's was. He was on the plane with Buddy Holly. How do I not know? I know. And I know. Richie I know, Valance. <gasps> and the big. Hello, babe. Big, he was a DJ, I uh, think, the, in Dallas. Big Jerry Lee the big Lewis. The big bopper. Chantilly lace and a pretty face mm-hmm. and a ponytail mm-hmm. hanging down. What was a his name? A wiggle and a walk and a giggle and a talk that, long. But did he Maybe have a... it's a world go round, round, round. What, okay, that so, was his real wait. name? There he goes. No, that wasn't his real name. I think it was J.P. Richardson. Oh, I don't yeah, know how that, that came to me. It's that Prevagen. But they it's called him the big... The Big, big bopper. bopper, yeah. You're using Prevagen now? Yeah. How many supplements do you take? Hey, you got to take supplements you take when you get old. The Mike Huckabee sleep and I've stuff. I've taking magnesium. Taurine. Magnesium? Huh? It must take you half taurine. a day. I don't really know what the taurine does, but you said it was good for me, so I take it. Jeez. And I take uh, with the stuff that Tony, uh, Tony Hawk takes. Tony Hawk, the skateboarder? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, he takes it. it <laughs> what is it? Uh, you know, it's search, uh, not, uh, it's, uh, I don't know, you take it if you're on statins. Oh, are you on statins too? Yeah, for blood uh, pressure. something or other, I don't know. The blood be... pressure is low sartin. What? Stat- low statin? Low sartin. What's low sartin? I, I don't know, but my blood pressure is perfect. I've decided I want to sleep with Kira Sedgwick. Who? Kara Sedgwick. Kevin Bacon's wife? Yeah. Why? I mean, I know she's because cute. They're, they're so happy. Don't break bugsy. them. No, I don't so. want to. Oh, Jan, what are what? you thinking? You're thinking physical contact, aren't you? you what? N- what did you say? What did I just say? I, I said want sleep. to sleep with. Sleep. Hello. Oh. oh. Lay next to. And chat, sleep. talk, sing. She's a very good singer. Well, if you're asleep, you won't. Eat, you don't even know who well, you're sleeping I'll with. Wait if that's till what you're I doing. Hear her softly going. I'll wait till she hears you softly go. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh I yeah, love you that have that machine. Uh, hey, have you ever watched any of their? They they uh, put on uh, uh, videos on, yes, on Facebook. I love and it. They sing together in the farm. Yeah, I love it. I love it. They're very, very. They good. seem very happy. Also, I want to get something else straight. You know that I have a slobber problem. You've pointed it out several oh, times. I yes, and I just saw a solution. I was there, at I was at Papo's. Solution. I was at Papo's, and there was a guy. You know how the kitchen is? This glass you can see the cooks back there, and this guy had a beard. Yeah, yeah, and he had. A mask uh-huh. over his beard. Over his beard, like and a, I thought, Woody, there you go. Well, I'll have you know what? that my not gynecologist, but my uh, <laughs> let's see, what uh, who is who is it that cleans your teeth? Dentist. Yeah, yeah proctologist. <laughs> no, not dentist. Hi, hi. Dental hygienist. Hi, my hygienist. hygienist yeah. You're she right. said, "Why well, you've got a lot of saliva. And I said, yeah, I know. <laughs> what can I do about it? She's do about it. That's great. That is a sign of excellent health. And I said, well, you know, it's been a, a problem of mine ever since I was like a little child. What the pillow said? gets soaking wet. She's, that's good. Did don't you, ever. Thank so much. <laughs> don't, You're don't so ever, sweet. <laughs> don't ever change that. That's really good for your immune system. She said, you should be... Very happy that you have saliva. Lots of saliva. Like you speaking of, there's a new weather person in town. I won't say where, but he does the weather. He seems to have a lot of saliva. Like, <laughs> storms tonight. Storms coming in the morning. I get, you know who you're doing now? Who? The car rental lady in San Francisco. Oh no, that was. She had her nose stopped up. She talked. She's more. She did more. I need glasses to do it, but. Yeah, I mean, what'd she say? Uh, exactly. When is your fly, flight leaving? 
Yes. What is your flight leaving, sir? <laughs> was that her? I don't know. I couldn't tell what she oh, was saying. Oh, I loved her. I just, I couldn't even talk One to her. One more thing I, I want to bring up that's just kind of serious, uh, and I won't mention the bank because we shouldn't. No, you shouldn't. But I was looking at the Moody's report yesterday, and my bank is on the list of banks that are in trouble. Uh oh, uh oh. So I stopped that by there today, me. huh? That scares and me. And they, oh, we don't know anything about that. What are you going to do? Take your I'm money not out? Gonna, no, no, I don't want to start you trust that. It? Mm-hmm. My dad buried money. He's the old school. He buried stuff in that's his backyard. Pretty, that's pretty old school. Real old school. He didn't trust. You know, he went through the depression. And he was scared of banks. Okay. But when he passed away, Should how we, weird was that? We had to go yeah. out and dig up the yard. Okay, so here's what I got. You, you can do uh, whatever you want first. We have um, uh, lies that people tell on the first date. Ooh. We have a letter about a, a woman whose uh, husband seems to be a little frisky. With her or other people? Uh, no, with somebody else. Uh-oh, uh-oh. And then we have a, a, con- a game that we can play. Oh. Want, want to play the game? Uh, do you want to see it's between I the game? I give you the slogan. Oh. No, no, no. Oh, no, uh, we're going to play, uh, I give you the slogan and you give me the product or business. Oh, okay, okay. King okay. of beers. Budweiser. Yes. <gasps> I got you. We try harder. So you don't have to. We <clears throat> what? Oh, sorry, that's Avis. In that, did I finish the line, though? Eat more chicken. Um, uh, Chick-fil-A. Yes. yes. Oh, yeah, I'm really good. Obey but... your thirst. Gatorade. Sprite. Sprite. Mm. Oh, no. You're not doing too well, Jay. I th- well, Those rating glory. points are Gator. sinking down. <laughs> glory. He's tired from... I'm busy looking at my ratings. Yeah, Easy, stupid. breezy, beautiful. Cover girl. Yes. Oh, I uh, this is... Yeah. I, man, I own this. Quality own. never goes out of style. Oh, shoot. Comfort in. Levi's. Oh. <laughs> it sounded so... Yeah, it sounded authority. That was good. It sounded like I knew what I was talking about. <laughs> because you're worth it. Ooh. Oh. Oh, you know that one. L'Oreal? Yes. Oh! What? <laughs> this is rigged. It's not. This I'm just rigged. I'm just really, really Maybe smart. she's born with it. Maybe it's, it's Maybelline. Yes. Oh. You're if good. it's makeup, I'm gonna know. And I mean look sang, at look at my sang face. A hit song in the seventies, Maybelline. Maybelline, why can't you be true? Well, Maybelline. The big bopper. Why can't you be true? No, I'll no. give you a hint. He's from Wentzville, Missouri. You done started back doing them things you, you. used to do. He was a major influence Chuck on the Beatles. Berry. Yes, <gasps> Chuck Berry. Oh. Very good. Did now, you that's know? Bonus round, so I got th- 50 that, points for that. That was, worth, 50 that was worth 50 points. He's way ahead of you now. How, th- this is rigged. Did you know he used to go to Chuck Berry's house? <laughs> yeah. And and Chuck Berry was nasty. Oh, I'm sure he yeah, nasty. he was. You know what he would say? Mm. No, you're th- say- <laughs> you're no, you're thinking. <laughs> no, it was Chuck Berry. He would say you're to thinking people, of "Ike Turner." No, it wasn't Ike Turner. No, Chuck Berry would say. <laughs> you, told, you told me that he said he went. <laughs> make a noise. Foul. No. Okay, never eat mind. My, people. Eat my foot. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. Okay. Can you do it? Will you say it? No. Please. Bet you can't eat just one. <laughs> Pringles? No. Lays. 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 That's correct. Lays. Sorry. The quicker pip- picker upper. Swift. Swift. Huh? Swift. Bounty. Bounty. Silly goose. Doggone it. <gasps> no rules, just right. Oh, I've. I know that one. No, I don't know. Outback. Oh, oh, I wouldn't have gotten that. No doers. No, wait. What? How doers get more done. Mm, I don't know. Home Depot. Oh. Think different. Steve Jobs came up with that one. IBM, Apple. Apple. Yes. The Steve Jobs. Better ingredients. Good. Better pizza. Papa John. Yes. Oh, uh, he's first. Man, That's toward all. the end there, I just sort of... Fizzled out, didn't it? Yeah, you were ahead there for a while. And then it just kind of went blank. It wasn't a sprint, Jan. It was a marathon. It was a marathon. Got it. Will you do the Chuck Berry thing? 
No. Whatever you play. What? Is not Chuck a bad Berry's word. Is still alive? I don't know. What? You think he's going to call you? You can't he's dead. You can't yeah. tell the story. He's not going to call you and be upset. Uh, that's fine. Well, we celebrated John Denver that one day, so let's take a look at Chuck Well, Berry. It, it, when I was in high school, or well, <clears throat> it was junior high, uh, and we moved out to Wentzville. I was in seventh grade, and my parents said, now, just because Chuck Berry lives a mile and a half that way, we better not catch you ever over there. Well, what did you tell me that for? Yeah. Oh, yeah. He died uh, in 2017. He died at 90. Oh, wow. Or, and he was nasty. nasty. And I played at a, a lounge called Fisher's when I was in, a senior in high school, went back to Winsville, and I was with the band called the Artisans, and I was their singer. And Chuck Berry came in one night. Was was down before on after Delmore. that party. After, what? The one party where he had... People at the pool, and he was walking around talking to people, being nasty. I don't remember that. He, he, I you can't were, even. You were at right. a different party. No, you, you told me the story. Mm-hmm. Eat, eat my foot. Mm-hmm. That's what he said. Okay, we got a. Um, you want um, lies on the first date or the letter from the woman who lies on the first date? Yeah, let me hear that I want to see if I've ever told any of them. Enough about me. Let's talk you about you. You do. Or be our been told. That I bet I've been told a lot of lies. I just said the first one. Gosh. What was it? Enough about you. Let's talk about me. I mean, no. Enough about me. Let's talk about you. That's a lie? <laughs> yeah. Oh. Basically, it's enough about me. Let's talk about you. What do you think about me? Uh, <laughs> this is the first time I've ever, ever, I've ever used Tinder. See, oh, I, I, don't know what, I bet people do say that. I've never used it. I, I you know I why? Know I didn't what it know is. what it was until I watched the show Shameless. I think we should make a Tinder account for Woody just to see what happens. Oh, he, we'll never you see look him just again. Just like your profile picture. <laughs> yeah, only like twenty years older. Um, I had nothing to do with the end of my last relationship. Oh. Mm-hmm. 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 Oh my goodness! She was crazy. Five hundred days of summer is my favorite movie too. Uh-huh. I don't. Rem- I don't. I'm not. Must a- be a chick flick. Yeah, I'm thinking our favorite chick flick is uh, Terms of Endearment. It is. Used to be. Oh. oh. Or beaches. Oh, beaches. Beaches is good. La, uh, what? Uh, the one with Ryan Gosling and um, Rachel uh, McAdams. Hmm. Dating Sarah Marshall? No. no. Oh, How about the come. notebook? Yes, that's it. Ryan Gosling and Rachel McAdams. Is Ryan Gosling, does he play... Uh, Ken? Ken. Yes. Okay. I love him. He's a good-looking dude. Yes, he is. You know, they should have got uh, Kira Sedgwick to play... Uh, Barbie? Barbie. <clears throat> What's your deal with Kira all of a sudden? No, no, no nothing. You get, Never you mind. get like... The, focused on yes, I do. one person. That's the way go, you get things done, Jan. Okay. You focus. Hey. The only reason I'm not working is because I can't decide which job offer to take. <laughs> that's good. I totally did not check your Instagram before we met. Mm. See, I've I don't I've never been this on is, Instagram. Yeah. This is Forget new about dating. physical stuff. I just want somebody to connect with Emotionally and spiritually. That's a lie? <laughs> you should know by now. What? Let me get the bill. I can afford it. <laughs> well, I think this went great. Oh, that's, that's a, a lie? lie? Yeah. Oh, I've been told that Hey, you're before. listening to the Woody <clears throat> and Janet podcast. I don't know what's wrong. <clears throat> I mowed yesterday without a mask. I'm sure there's a... <clears throat> supplement for that somewhere well i don't i don't know yeah. what would oh, you recommend oh, would you, you want some nuts <laughs> those are peanuts huh these nuts <clears throat> what these nuts? Can you imagine people having a peanut allergy i tell you what they used to serve them on airplanes remember that mm-hmm. i never knew as a kid <laughs> my voice is gone. anyone Having peanut allergies. What do you think it's caused from? I don't know. What happened to you? I don't know. I got I got like weed dust in my throat. Did you I'm know that? I'm gonna try to read this letter. 
<coughs> As you want. You want me to take it? You don't have COVID, do you? <coughs> I think I do. Jesus. Thanks for the heads up. God. Okay, there's the letter. <clears throat> All right. I went to surprise my husband during lunch at work the other day. I had bought him food and I was going to eat with him. When I was walking to his office, I passed by the mail room and saw something that caught my eye. When I looked back in there, I saw my husband pulling himself away from another woman. Dun, dun, dun. That, ooh, that woman was a 23-year-old that works with my husband. My husband is 33 years old. Huh. I stormed out, and he followed me. We had a very ugly conversation after that. He said that nothing serious was going on between them, and then they would, and they would just flirt in the office, and he took... And he took it a little too far. Yeah, what's wrong but with that? But just today, he swears nothing else happened. We have two young kids together. The problem here is that my husband works with my family's company. Uh-oh. I quit to stay home with the kids. If I make any kind of move, it could jeopardize his job. My husband has different qualifications than me, so it's not like I could just step in and do his job. Plus, I'm not sure I'm ready to go back to work yet, as both of our kids are still at home for most of the day. Mm. So, do I make any other moves and risk my marriage and my family's income, or just forgive this one infraction? I think this letter is meant for you. By the way, if you'd like to write to us, while Janet thinks of an answer to that question. No, I don't have to think about it. I mean, one infraction. Yeah. He's shady. Have you no... Forgiveness in your heart at all? I no mercy. do, I do, but I, it's just I don't know. I one in there's nothing. She he said there's nothing between them. I wonder what she meant feel? by I saw him pulling away. I know. I want to know how close they were. Yeah, pulling away. Were they kissing? Because that would well, if he was in infer view, there's something in the mail room while she passed by the open door. It couldn't have been too bad, or they would have closed the door. Well, maybe it was you like... You can see that on Kira Sedgwick's uh, show. Uh, again, the again, Kira Sedgwick. Huh? Oh. oh, my good! What'd you see her in? Hmm? You saw her. You must have... She's on The something. Closer two hours every day. Oh, okay. okay. A wonderful actress. I don't know. I mean, I, I, I don't want to say she should her get a divorce. Big, but... Huh? Gosh. I don't no, want to she... say she should get a divorce, but... No, of course. But she, oh. maybe they should get counseling. You mean Kira Sedgwick? No! You have she is taking I, up way too much space I in your head. Hate divorce. A divorce is an ugly thing. It's it a is ugly. What do you thing. suggest here? You think it's fine? I think you know why you think just... that's fine? Because I bet you've You were the guy in the mailroom. <laughs> exactly. I've been the guy in the mailroom. <laughs> have you? <gasps> oh you guys. So do I make any other uh. moves and risk my marriage? Don't risk your marriage. If your dad's running the company, you got a little pull there. How would you I'd, guys you feel? Gotta if the tables and, were turned, though, how would you feel if huh? you walked by and saw your wife? Depends on what, with another what guy. she means by pulling away. Meaning if that's they were close from an enough. Embrace or from lips from lips, then you got a little problem there. Yeah, a little. But if it's just, you know, rubbing, like if she's rubbing his shoulders or. Uh. Okay. Uh, Who would know? Thank you, everybody. Thank you, Jay Stevens. You're an excellent producer. And uh, this is Woody P. Snow. This is Janet Lane. And uh, we'll see ya. See ya. This has been Around the Ozarks Rewind with Woody and Janet. If you have questions or topics for the show, email Woody and Janet at AroundTheOzarks.com. 